We're engaged now. Can you believe it? I can. Feels good. Galsworthy put down his sword and, and took up his plow. He became the greatest apple farmer in the kingdom. Men used to travel all across Europe to eat his remarkable apples. But deep inside, he missed the dragons almost as much as they gave him nightmares. He and Princess Brea raised seven happy children, and none of them ever knew that their father had once been the bravest warrior hmm. in the world. The end. Who wrote that? I love it. I truly love it. Frank and Heck. Abigail, dear. Frank Heck. What's for dinner? <laughs> What's for dinner? Away with you, you no good parasite. You cook. Actually, that's not a bad idea. <laughs> John, come out here. Hey, John. Abigail. Sadie. Charles. I found him. I found Micah. No. I got a lead. Here we go. One of his boys wanted for murdering a woman. Been seen drinking in strawberry. If we can get to him, he'll lead us to Macca. But I gotta go now. You coming? No. He's not coming. I will. That's your business. His business is here. Yeah. Yeah, I'll ride with you. No, I'm... <laughs> I'm begging you. Me... Uh... No! <laughs> you risk all this? For what? For Micah? All this? Well, this wouldn't exist if it weren't for Arthur, Sadie, and all the folks that fell. If I let him go, this place ain't no more real than, than one of Jack's dragons. I'm begging you. And I'm begging you to understand. This is it. This is... Please. Sound like Please Dutch. try to... I ain't got no other choice. Keep an eye on the place for me. Of course. Please! <laughs> Let's go kill this son of a bitch then. Can't believe it. It's happening! Let's get to Strawberry before he dries out. Alright. Which one of Mike's boys is it? Cleet. Which one was Cleet? The big one or the little one? The one with the rat face. My memory is they both had rat faces. The little bastard with the rat face, then. <laughs> Him? <laughs> yeah, he'll talk. You're damn right he will. We owe this to Arthur. You think Arthur cared about revenge? I'm not so sure. Especially not at the end. He cared about stopping Micah. And that's what we're doing. I hear you're taking bounties now. And I hear you're building houses. Mm-hmm. When I'm not killing old friends. Yeah, everyone's changed, hey, guys. We get it. Nowadays, I'm almost always killing old friends. Old friends and new. Ain't that right, John? Seems that way. You interested in bounty hunting, Charles? My last assistant <laughs> was put out to pasture. No, that work ain't for me. I, uh, I think I might get out of here. Go north. Canada. Find a woman. Start a family. I can. I see how that life. Well, I'd like to try it. Ooh, wait, hey, John. You've given him the family book. Huh, maybe. I thought we would have inspired him to a life of celibacy and isolation. Hmm. You know, I've been thinking I might get out of here too. Down South America, maybe? It's wild, but less mean, I guess. I'd run protection for a gold mine, or also sounds up like Dutch. Jesus. Revolutionary. I don't know. Something. 
see something else at least. That all sounds good. Yeah, it all sounds real fine. But we got some business to take care of first. That we do. Okay, Strawberry, this is it. We leave our horses by the bridge, then we find him. Okay, John, Charles, you take the other side of the river. I'll stay on this one. If we meet in the middle, we would have covered most of the town. If he's here, we'll get him. Okay, let's go. I want my guns. Not my bow and arrow. Uh, let's go semi-auto. Are we gonna go or what? Yeah, we are. All right. Where are you stop going? That man. He's wanted for murder. Hey, hey stop, 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 stop. I'll head him off. Can't escape us, Cleve. Ain't no point in trying. Move. Come here, friend. I don't know huh? anything. He got past. Doesn't seem so bad. Hello, Cleve. Remember us? Damn it. Joe, you gonna take a turn? Hey, 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 we're all buddies, ain't we? Sure, Sadie. With pleasure. Now, where's Micah? Micah! Whoa. Spit it out. I don't believe you. Hey, 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 hey! Come on! Lay into him! Tell me! Wait, 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 wait! Where's Micah? I don't know. I ain't seen him. We fell out. And you know what? I'm bored of this. Let's hang the bastard. Whoa, really? What? Good idea. Oh, wait, hold on. Bring him up to the gallows. Okay. Ah, no, stop it! Move it! Get back! Everyone loves Real convenient. Hang. They're right Come here. On. Hey, Cleet. What do you think? Listen up. Hold on. Keep moving. I, I swear. Get. You heard the lady. Get up there. No, no, come here, you bastard. Move me. Come on. Move. Here. I want you stood right here. Still. All right, string the no good murdering bastard up. Put it around his neck. Let's try this again. I like how they have the rope Where's like Mike? here permanently. No, 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 no. Where's Mike? I already told you I ain't seen him. You lie. It ain't my fault. He tried to kill me. Where's Micah? I believe. Talk, I kind of believe him. Pull this lever. Talk. No, 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 no. We can move it slightly. Don't, don't. We, we, we. He's up in the mountain. Oh, so you do know? I think it's. He's up in Mount Hagen. You got a whole gang now. Bad man doing bad things. I, I tried to stop him from murdering that little girl. We fell out. Honest. Please, I'm, I'm one of the good guys. Didn't realize we had an audience here. No, no. I, I told you. I don't know. Do it. The bastard deserves it. Uh, I can't something do something it, feels Sadie. off here. Not like this. Thank you. Thank you, John. No, 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 no. Come on now. You won't ever see me again. I said hang him. Oh, as you wish. Oh, Whoa, Sadie. Piece of shit. Well Let's move on. Okay, Dutch. 
Come on! A little rat said Mount Hagen. Whoa. He also said, I think. Naka, we're coming for you. That was like out of character for her. I think Micah's got her fully hooked here. Take us up into the high mountains. Lead the way. There's an old watchtower up there they might be using for a camp. Whoa. There must be a sniper. Get in cover. He got hit. You alive, Charles? Just Can I grab you? Be careful. Who is this bastard? Okay. Short run. A bit of ground every time. Okay. Oh! Here's a break. Move it. Up here, box of bullets. Canteen, it's a jerk. Yikes. Yikes. I can't see where he's coming from yet. Now, moving on. Oh, there he is. Oh, ho, ho, who's the sniper now, bitch? You got it. Okay, let's go back to Charles. How's that jerky tasting? Oh no. You hey, okay? You're okay. You're okay. I will be. Okay. Go on. Go on now. Move fast. They'll come down that hill and kill us all. Come on, John. I don't want to leave him. Hey, they know we're coming now. I will be fine. We're obviously in the right I'll place. You up. I just, I just can't move fast. Okay. Come on, John. Shit. Shit is right. Come on, fast, fast. Oh, I can actually clean this faster? Did not know. Anyone with my cabal is gonna get a book! Oh, the fall. for blood. Where are you, 
a sad sack of shit. Go, Sadie. Come here, you Tiny. Whoa. Get your hands off her. <laughs> Oh! No way. Oh, no way. You all right? Just fine. You don't look too fine. Come on. You're bleeding pretty bad. Ain't nothing. You should sit down. I'm fine. You're dying. I'll be fine. Just... Sit, Suck okay. the venom out. <laughs> I, I ain't dying. I ain't. I hope not. I ain't dying. Just go get him. I'll be fine. I just need to rest. Uh, okay. Charles, stay with her. Charles, you worry about yourself. I'll be up there who it is. in a minute. Holy you shit. Gotta have it just show it up. But I got something to take care of, sure. Just you left, is it? Yeah. Just me. I was kind of hoping I could kill you. Likewise. That was Joe. We got him. It's close. It's That little mountain peak. Like, why would these guys be defending them? I guess they, a lot of people. Oh shit! A lot of people be asking the same thing about Arthur, or not Arthur, uh, Dutch. Remember where at the very beginning when we had to find. John in the snow. Now we're back in this scenario. I don't think they care.
What's going on with those trees down there? Micah. Oh, come You're on, here. Micah. Come on. I dare ya. Hello, Scarface. Shit, he is here. Did you miss me? Not exactly. Not much. <laughs> Been a few years. <laughs> How's that, uh, mm, whore of yours? Holy shit. She's good. Didn't reckon I should waste my time killing you. But I felt different. So it seems. Well, maybe after all this is over, I'll go pay her a call. Hmm? And the boy. <laughs> Whatever you say. Oh shit! There's no moving. Okay, no moving. <laughs> okay, I'm like, all right. I'll make you rich, real rich. And we can't dead eye either. What is this? Oh, look. Come on now, Micah. At least die like a man. <laughs> Hell Get him. It's just Get like him. old times. <laughs> Come on. You turn around and start walking. <laughs> You got me! Just like old times. Hmm? Oh yeah, just like that. All manner of folk paying social calls. You gotta be oh, shitting me. Mrs. Adler? Whoa. It's been quite a while. <laughs> Wow. Now, John. Now. What were you saying? What are you doing here, Dutch? Same as you, I suppose. Dutch and I are teaming up once more. We got money. We got dreams. Join us, John. Join us. Let her go. Now I can't do that, John. Dutch. Dutch, come on now. You shot at me, son. You started. You betrayed me. You're a piece of shit. I could say the same as you. I was trying to do my best. You? You just cared for yourself. I think differently. Join us. Join us, John. It's not happening. Let her go. She ain't well. I don't want to kill you, John. Arthur saved my life. More than once. Arthur's been dead a long time. This is a new century. Dutch. Dutch. We all did our best for you. Ain't our fault. Things turned out the way they did. 
Dutch, killing me won't solve nothing. Put down your gun, Marston. Say something, Dutch. Say something. I ain't got too much to say no more. Oh, shit. Dutch shot him? He shot me. Whoa. <laughs> you shot me pretty good. Whoa. My pleasure. <laughs> I don't think he'd be walking. But okay. Thank you. I, I, you okay? Fine. You're crazy. Well, I hope so. Help me up. Uh, Let's go get Charles. There's money. Lots of money. In the cabin. It's black water. I'll go see. Hurry up. I got a wedding I want to go to. <laughs> Holy frick. <sighs> Gonna need more than that. Charles is still up. Cool. Good. It's over, Abigail. It's all over. I'm going to oh, where the sun burns in the heat stays in come and come away by my side. Holy right. moly, we've done it! To where the my god, that was so good. Turns to dust that was exceptional, man. God is never what an amazing game. That's like my side. It's one of the best right games I've played in a very, very long time. It's, de it's definitely in my top three. Or of all time. It seemed to make sense when Brother Santo said, Oh, one more run be enough. I'm gonna be enough. If there's anything that uh, comes up here, I'll, I'll stop talking. But what a, what an amazing experience. The story, the gameplay, like everything. And, and there's still things that I haven't even delved into. Like, we haven't dived into hunting very much. We didn't dive into fishing very much. We didn't dive into just going off the path and doing whatever. But those are things that I would like to actually be doing. Not a bad wedding party. Even uncle looks not bad there. Um, but yeah, from start to finish, like just totally engrossed in the whole experience. So I think this is like, this is what, 80 episodes? That's a long, that's a long game. And for the amount of stuff that we didn't even get into yet, it's very impressive and so much detail, so much, you can see the care to which they've gone into here and just made it an experience that nobody's going to forget. Like really, really well done. I'm really excited to see what they do with Red Dead Online. I think that would be fun. I've never really gotten into a Rockstar Online game before. And uh, definitely something I'll be diving into. 
when possible. But yeah, I've I've nothing but good things to say about it. Nothing but good things. There was just like this story-wise major crescendo when uh, Arthur died. We knew Arthur was going to die. We didn't know how he was going to die, but we knew he was eventually going to die. Um, and then fast forwarding a couple years later and spending time with John and seeing how he developed his life and got to where they ended up is uh, was a pretty cool way of doing it. Really cool way of doing it. It was... Some people would say that it was pretty slow, like almost felt like chores at times, taking care of the farm and building the barn and all that kind of stuff. But I think it was a good way to kind of contrast what we were doing for the previous, you know, 60 hours or whatever. So uh, yeah, I actually really liked the slow pace at the end there. And then obviously getting to have the showdown with Micah was beautiful, absolutely beautiful dutch shooting him oh my god ah oh, it's so good sad thing is is we know where this goes now right from the first red dead we know well i don't i i know it's weird to not spoil it because it's like nine years old uh but in case people haven't seen that i won't say anything specific but there are things that we know like when i made the choice between uh, helping John get to his family and, and taking the money. For me, knowing what we know of the first game, it was kind of an easy decision to be like, oh, well, okay, he'll likely be fine. So let's go get the money. Uh, if you didn't know that, you probably default to go and help John. And then it would be interesting to see how that shakes down and what's different there. But uh, at the end of the day, not a game that's based around a lot of decisions or branching trees or anything like that. Um, but still, when presented with the odd choice, it was nice to have that. Who's this? Pinkertons. Desert road, desert plain. <laughs> yeah, um, obviously there's so many good things I could say about it. Um, I'm trying to think of like any real negatives. The only thing, the only thing if I was nitpicking is sometimes the controls felt a bit loose, like not as tight as you might want them to be. Um, especially like riding the horse sometimes you feel like you're homing into a tree and there's like nothing you can do about it. I'm pretty sure everybody that's played the game has crashed their horse multiple times. Uh, but when you do it for a bunch of people that are watching, <laughs> it just amplifies the embarrassment a little bit. Uh, but it was fun nonetheless. So, Anyways, I'll, uh, I'll stop talking here. It was a great experience. I really liked it a lot. And I hope you guys enjoyed the story. We'll uh, let this play out, see if there's any cutscenes at the end or anything. And if there are, I'll definitely show you. Otherwise, uh, I really appreciate you guys spending time with me and uh, going through this experience with me. I think what will likely happen is we'll be put back into the world to kind of just do whatever we want. Um, I had an idea to maybe do some of the legendary animal hunting quests, uh, like for a stream or something that I would eventually upload to YouTube. Um, might be a cool way to kind of dive back in here and just talk about the game and hang out with you guys a little bit. Um, so that's one option. I don't know when Red Dead Online releases, but definitely we'll be diving into there. And uh, yeah, just glad I got to play this. I'm glad that you guys enjoyed it. So thanks so much. We'll see you in the next uh, video.
See the fire in your eyes. See the fire in your eyes. See the fire in your eyes. See the fire in your eyes.
that's crazy. scouted.
Carson. Since you bought this millstone around our necks, we better try and keep this place going. I paid our debt with that money I... Uh... I don't want to talk about that money. <laughs> and no more that... It's over, Abigail. I'm sure. Then get to work on this ranch you own and raising your boy. Yes, ma'am. Are you being sarcastic, John Mars? Never. Me? <laughs> Never. <laughs> Good. Anyway, I thought you liked this place. No, John, I don't like it. I love it. It's home. Hello, Mrs. Marston. It ain't my handsome husband. Why is she Abigail 2? What happened to Abigail 1? stay safe now. Uh-huh. <gasps> She's been replaced. This is the sci-fi ending. <laughs> I guess this is uh, this is where we can kind of just do whatever it is that we would like to be doing, uh, which is pretty cool. Do we still have all the all of like the places marked? Yeah, we do. We have uh, all of the wildlife marked. I think if we take a look around for it, yeah, that's cool. And then you just play as John. It's kind of trippy, but. Kind of cool. All right, guys. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed. And uh, this is a really nice farm that we got here. So we're going to go live in it. Bye now.